Hello my friends, today we are inside of Lightroom and we will be testing the Enhance feature. If you did not know, Enhance is over here under Photo and Enhance. And this Enhance, what it does, it increases the resolution of your image and it's kind of the way Topaz Gigapixel AI works. So on today's episode, I will show you how to upscale this image in Lightroom and then we will also do it on Gigapixel AI and see, compare them, see which one yields better results. And you might be surprised of this one. So this image is a image of my daughter. This I took this one with my iPhone. As you can see, I took it with my Apple iPhone 12. And uh, there was no fancy light going on or anything. It's just in my kitchen. She was sitting by the window and some beautiful light was on her. And of course, it helps. She's a very pretty girl. And uh, I had to take this picture, but I do want to upscale it. So let's see how we do that. First, let's go into the Gigapixel AI. So I will go to Photo and then Edit In and we'll go into Gigapixel AI. I will edit a, a copy with Lightroom Adjustments. Go to Edit and then Gigapixel AI will open your image. And you're presented with this dialog. And here we can see the resolution. It's 3024 by 4032. And upscaled by two times it will give us 6048 by 864. Now this is the modes, these four squares and we will wait for them to upload all of them and for to update it all of them and then we can see which one we like better. So we have very compressed low resolution standard and lines and by the way this very compressed I can see it gives me a lot of artifacts. The lines it's not so great so for this image, I think either the low resolution or standard would work great. So I'll go with the low resolution, click on it, and you see, pick the low resolution and then just apply it. And this will uh, do its work and send it back into Lightroom. So there is our TIFF file. This is the one that came back from Gigapixel AI. As you can see, it's 6048 by 864. And this is our original image, the JPEG from my phone, 3024 by 432. Let's compare them. I am going to select both of them, go over here where it says X and Y, and now we get to compare them side by side. This is the Gigapixel version on the right, and this is the original photo on the left. If I go at 100%, Gigapixel did really good, but I feel like we lost some details. It's not as sharp anymore in the eye, and... All overall, I think was not the best of uh, upscaling here. So let's see how Lightroom will do. Remember, this is not a raw image. This is just a JPEG that I took with my phone. So maybe that could be the reason. So this is my JPEG image. And I'm going to make a virtual copy of it so that we can keep the original and the gigapixel version. So go to create virtual copy. And there you go. This is our copy. And now I will take the original, go into photo and enhance. And here I don't have a raw photo, so that is unclicked. So I want to choose the super resolution and create stack. Click enhance. And this works really, really fast. As you can see, the progress bar is moving amazingly fast. So this is the enhanced version. And the one next to it is the TIFF file that we did in Gigapixel. So let's compare the Gigapixel versus the Enhance. I will select both of them and go into the comparison mode. Enhance, as you can see, it's on the right side and the Gigapixel is on the left side. They are both 6048 by 8064 uh, pixels, as you can see. So the same resolution, the right side is Enhanced, the left side is Gigapixel. I'm gonna go into 100% so the Enhance is on the right side, the Gigapixels is on the left. As you can see right away, Enhance from Lightroom did so much better. It preserved the skin texture. We have sharpness into the eyelashes. The eye looks really sharp. So everything is just looks amazing with the Enhance. There is no artifacts. There's no artifacts into Gigapixel either, but we did lose some detail and the eye doesn't look sharp anymore. So I think, I'm sorry, my lawnmowers are here, they are in the background. I will try to wrap up this video really quick, but I just wanted to show you how the Lightroom built-in Enhance AI works so amazing and really it could be your go-to program when you need to enhance an image. 
So you really don't need to buy any kind of plugins or anything. Look at the sharpness of that. Everything looks great. So I totally recommend it. Lightroom Enhance. And that is it for today. Thank you so much for watching. My name is Skylar Ewing and I'll see you in my next video.